hi all so welcome to this channel once again and in this video session we will discuss a uh, copy to HTML command which is a cl command in ibm s400 so using this command we can copy data uh, from uh, save file to the stream file but that's not uh, specific or uh, it's not related only to this save file copying a save file to the stream file uh, it can even copy a source member using this command we can copy a source member database file member to the stream file or even a program describe file to the stream file so i already created a video uh, on this that uh, we can copy how to copy a uh, stream database file member to the stream file in ibm s world so you can uh, watch it from uh, here uh, from a channel or you can search on the google copy to stmf you will you'll find the video so this video is already uh, there where i showed you how we'll be copying the database file member to the stream file now this time i'm going to copy uh, a save file to the stream file member stream file basically so here the most important thing is to uh, reach to the save file location so uh, basically every library resides in the qss lib and that qss lib and that library contains the save file so this would be the path till the save file so qss.lib slash slash qss.lib slash uh, library name dot lib and save slash save file dot file so if it would be a member then uh, let's say uh, if it's a source physical file uh, uh, in the previous case uh, it would be source physical file dot file and then, and then the member dot member name dot member so here we will stick up to this point and then we are going to copy the data from a save file to a stream file so let's move on to the uh, uh, demo of this just do work link just delete this we don't need this and uh, uh, let me create a save file first so for creating a save file i need to uh, use the command create savf and then take f4 so i can create a save file uh, test sav2 and then the library name is the class one copy to stmf demo is the text and that's not required let's uh, copy this uh, let's create this sorry so file this created in library this let's check sav2 so you can see uh, that's a file and of attribute save file currently if i look at the save file using this command dsp savf test sav2 so there are no records in the save file so let's now copy uh, some so some so some some file or some source uh, source physical file let's say i'm copying save obj so I am copying tds 2 ddl 2 which is a source physical file having some members and the library is the class 1 device is star savf take f10 and then specify the library and so say file name test sav2 press enter so one object copied in library this just again check now you can see one object is there which is a source physical file you can take option 5 to display you will see all the, the members uh, there in the source physical file that, that, that object so now uh, we are ready uh, we have uh, this save file and uh, we are ready to copy it to the string file so what command we will be using that's a uh, copy to stmf copy the stream file take f4 here we need to uh, traverse through the ifs path qsys dot lib slash the library name dot lib slash 
and then uh, let's specify the save file name test sav2 dot file so this is going to be your path till the save file so that's the side in this easy class one library and uh, that easy class one library is basically side in qsys.lib so we don't have the independent asp so if it was independent asp then asp name first slash asp name then slash qsys.lib so now uh, the stream file is going to be in my current directory slash home slash easy class slash and let's create a sav save file one so this is going to be my stream file name save savf1 just take f10 there are no further things so here one important thing uh, let me tell you so here are star none add or uh, replace so if i took star add here so you will be getting the error that this option is not allowed when copying a save file because uh, it could be possible that uh, the save file or the, uh, the stream file already exists and have some data and you are trying to copy the save file to that so that's not possible and because you are adding some your save file you are not going to replace that so save file in itself in a stream file won't contain anything else other than that save file so let me take a poll here again so either i can go for a star none or a star replace so if i uh, do this and just press enter you can see object is copied just take f1 so object this which is a save file successfully copied to object this that's a string file location in this ecs id this that's what the ecs id of the job is uh, so if i uh, do work link again and we'll see uh, that the save file savf1 string file is created successfully uh, on the ifs so if i do a five you will see the data like this because that's a uh, uh, save file that's not a normal source physical file member on the save file so you can see this and you can later on restore this to a save file from the stream file that's some other commands there we'll be discussing with uh, uh, about them in the in the next videos which i'm going to uh, have for you so uh, this was the file where we have the source physical file member which is uh, copied uh, using the copy to HTML the same command and that we, that video is here you can watch it so um, now you, you learn the concept that how we can copy a, a save file to a stream file using the copy to HTML command or you can copy a database file member that is a source physical file member uh, to the stream file in abms folder using the same copy to stmf command so um, that's all here in this video so thank you and have